It's supposed to be a moment What good is being the one when you the only one that knows it What's good bitch ass niggas It's the goat god in this bitch <laughs> So 2k came out with a fucking gameplay vlog Or not vlog, blog, whatever the fuck this shit is i don't fucking know but i mean <laughs> apparently man this this game oh my god like this, this is just gonna be the greatest game ever like so i tell you you gotta stop being so negative <laughs> you, <laughs> you you just have to stop like like th this this is not like the past two k's where they say the same shit in different words you know, you know, but I, I'm, I'm going to read some of this shit to y'all, man. I'm going to talk about it. I'm going to let y'all know what's in this motherfucking blog. Link in the description if you want to read this shit for your motherfucking self. And I'm going to have the trailers <coughs> and all that shit going in the background, bro. So let me read some of this shit to y'all, bro. This shit is funny. Some of our top engineers spent the entire dev cycle working on a new motion engine. Don't they say that every year? Some some new type of movement and it turned out to be a huge game changer to put it simply movement is no longer driven by animations in nba 2k18 don't they say this every year this 2k is not dri animation driven we put in completely new animations but it's the same animations <laughs> like what <laughs> i don't understand <laughs> it's just an animation based game they say this every rollout because this is how you appeal to people, bro. I'm telling y'all, man, this is marketing, my nigga. This is, it sound good. It sound real good, bro. It sound real nice. I'm, I'm going to read some more, man. I'm going to read you some more shit. That sound real nice. This gave us the ability to control exactly how quickly a given player can accelerate, deaccelerate, cut, and turn as well as his speeds for different states. Walking, running, shuffling, sprinting, etc. Simply based on his attributes, the new motion engine then takes this data and dynamically finds and stitches together the animations it needs in real time to animate the character. Nothing is canned. Nothing is predetermined. Everything is done on the fly. The results are night and day. It's something you'll notice as soon as you pick up the sticks this year. That sounds so nice, bro. <laughs> but this is... It's, I promise you, 2K is not going to run like this, my nigga. I'm trying to tell you, bro. Like, I really got to read this part right here. This part made me laugh. Like, deep inside to the depths of my motherfucking being, to the to the core of young swan, my nigga. Th th this, made me, this made me chuckle, my nigga. Like, dead ass. Like, listen to this, bro. They got a whole section. Skills still matter. Wait, what? <laughs> Didn't you just drop the motherfucking worst 2K ever? The 2K that took the least skill out of all motherfucking 2Ks? I'm going to read this part. and it's, 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 it's so funny, bro. If you guys read this, man. Look, look if y'all want to really like just, just look back on the past 2Ks, these little blogs that they fucking released, man. I'm telling you, they say the same type of shit, bro. You remember when Agent made that video showing that how they deleted all the the fucking shit showing that um, skills matter this year? They deleted all that shit, bro. Why, why are they still saying skills still matter? I'm, I'm, I'm going to read this to you, bro. Last year, I mentioned how much we focused on the skill of the gamer being the king. In deciding who wins and loses. That's a fucking lie. Because I'm the greatest. And you know I had a little bit of control. But not a lot. With NBA 2K18. That focus remained. What? But definitely evolved from last year. I think the main course of the evolution. Was defining what skill meant. Last year NBA 2K17. Put a very large focus on stick skills. Bitch where? <laughs> let me chill, let me chill. <laughs> this is stop my legal. Let me stop. Pause. <laughs> and while that focus was good, it also took away.
from some of the aspects that traditionally made 2K gameplay so great. No, like everyone, anyone that knows anything knows that that year was, this year was ass. So this basically just discredits this whole article, bro. They're trying to sell you a product. This shit is not going to be what you think, my nigga, okay? They think they did a good job last year. I'm sure 17 sold way more than 16. They're going off of numbers, bro, okay? This shit gonna keep getting bigger. This is basketball, bro. <laughs> I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you, bro. I just want a good game, bro. <laughs> this is shit crazy, bro. Yo, so listen to this shit, bro. Now, I'm reading this from the blog, my nigga. I'm telling y'all, bro. I'm the realest nigga on this shit. You gotta listen to me, bro. Tell your friends to tell a friend about me, bro. I'm trying to tell you niggas, man. I'm trying to save your dreams. I'm, I'm reading this right from the blog, my nigga. Green releases are still in the game, but aren't solely based on release timing. What the fuck? Without going into detail on how everything works under the hood, I'll just say that the design for excellent releases is much smarter than before and can say with confidence that green hunting in quotation marks my nigga won't be a problem this year what the fuck does that mean to you hmm? that means that you're gonna be able to get them green lights <laughs> now i've been saying this in a lot of videos dog a lot they're making the game appeal more to casual users Dead ass. That's what they're doing, bro. So it's going to be a lot of <laughs> cash. Shit going to be easy. Contested shots going to fall. But y'all will see. Y'all will see, my nigga. Y'all think I just be talking, bro. You'll see. <laughs> that, that Look, it's just like how Call of Duty is, bro. It's like if you play a... How, how do I explain this? If you play a first person that's very popular like Call of Duty... A little fucking eight-year-old can get kills on it. But if you were to let that kid play fucking like SOCOM, he would not get a kill. Like, that's what they're doing to 2K, bro. I'm telling you, bro. <laughs> but it's smart. It's business. But for someone like me, it it, it ain't what it ain't what I like. It's not <clears throat> I don't like that shit, man. Now, let me read this part to y'all, man. This, this shit, it sounds promising, but I honestly, guys, I've lost hope in 2K. I hope it's fun. Like, I really do. Like, I really do, my nigga. And for a lot of y'all stupid ass niggas, you'll be like, why do you always complain about 2K but still play it? First of all, I make money from this shit. Second of all, I've been roasting 2K since before I even knew how to make a youtube my nigga like i would just roast the fucking game with my friends and shit that's what niggas do you guys go outside my nigga you have any like black friends like we roast the shit out of the game and we still play it like that's just what people do bro it's it's like a hate love thing it's like you play something and you're like man i hate this shit blah blah like the, what the fuck how stupid minded can you be like you little dumb motherfucker now and plus it's basketball like i love that this is the only playable basketball like i'm tired of saying that shit you little dumbass niggas use your fucking head think about it man like like you you think you're saying something that let me stop i make this video way too long let me chill you know so in the cut let me read this part to y'all man this year when you hold the sprint and move the pro stick in the same direction of your movement when driving laterally, you'll get these really nice and explosive hop jumpers. Now, y'all know I'm the OG Grandmaster motherfucking sensei of hop jumpers, man. I invented the fucking curry. I don't, I don't know if I invented normal too, but y'all know my like my main arsenal of killing your bitch ass is the motherfucking hop jumper. Like, like I I, I hop jump your bitch ass and I uh, dunk. You already know how I do. But I mean a lot. Um annoying and whoever else was going i think it was just annoying he said hop jumpers were done but i mean they, they saying these bitches be explosive so you already know what i do and he said holding in the opposite direction of your drives will trigger these cool snatchback jumpers hopefully that's a thing in the game because that happens often 
hop jumpers, snatch back jumpers, dribble pull ups. It's 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 the norm in in actual basketball, but apparently like they it's just unrealistic in 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 2K. I mean, apparent you know people who are just like 2K ballers like they don't watch actual basketball. But hey, <laughs> that's that's besides the facts. Now this nigga talking about cradle layups, and um he explains how to do them. He says they're great for knifing through traffic and protecting yourself from getting stripped. One last note about layups and the layup package were reworked a bit. Now you can equip the following packages. So as you can read in the title, I put some jelly shit, you know, they say circus Kyrie type jelly layups. So that that's going to be how you're going to be able to jelly in NBA 2K18. Crafty Stephen Curry scoop layups around the back finish, etc. I wonder, like, I wish that like layups like they will actually matter but in no 2k they they don't matter like i've literally seen one person use layups to their advantage and that's gg two times he's a shot creator fucking cancer his records fucking cancer plays twos and he be tear dropping niggas like dead ass like a lot of like nobody does that shit but he's cancer and <laughs> i think he used the steph curry layup but in just like normal like europe's or layups aren't beneficial you would think like if like you're getting trailed and some shit they would be way more beneficial but 2k don't know how to implement that okay like you might as well just dump like it's stupid bro how hard is it to make it like i don't know bro like i remember in the past two k's euroing was very powerful very effective isn't that like one of the main scoring options my nigga but let, let me get back to the game man euro specialist the perfect package for Dwayne wade explosive now, this is a this is another part explosive designed for long jumpers who can explode off a launch pad like russell westbrook that sound kind of that sound kind of nice and then now they got a floater specialist Lots of nice quick teardrops, a LA, Tony Parker, or D Rose. This it sounds nice. I hope it matters, bro. Like to be honest, bro. It would make it, it would like really fuck with the skill gap, bro. Like <sighs> long athlete. Great for long swings like Giannis, the Greek. I don't know how to say his name. Greek feet. Then they got tank. Now niggas was tweeting me this part. They saying this is how I guess I I don't fucking know. I guess I play. Tank modeled after strong athletic finishers like LeBron. So you can get them big body animations. Then they got unathletic small. Blah blah blah. Who the fuck knows? And um they got some other shit. Let me... <laughs> Let's see. So I'm gonna start summing up these long ass fucking paragraphs. <laughs> So they're saying that the triple jab steps this year are going to be fucking like amazing for for deadly dribblers. Now, I don't believe this is the case. I think they're just trying to sell a product, my nigga. And no 2K have jab steps been effective when like top tier niggas are playing against each other. Like they might do it for show, but niggas ain't really, you know. <laughs> And they're they're saying um also you know how Kobe always did that um that foul shit like the shoot when you the niggas jump at him they're saying that that's in the game. So um I think that's going to be fucking cancer but it seemed cool. <laughs> Hopefully that shit only activate when niggas jump at you. I never jump, but there's a lot of bum ass niggas that do that shit so you know, we'll see my nigga. Now, I've been saying, my nigga, I've been saying they not going to kill dribble gods, bro. I've been saying it, man. Every year you able to dribble like a motherfucking circus monkey, just fucking everybody's baby Allen Iversons and shit, even though they got a lot of fuck ass animations. But especially this year with how dribble gods blew up, my nigga, you really think they're going to take it out for the next year? No. <laughs> don't believe the hype my nigga i've been telling y'all man uh, nigga swan know everything bro but i'm gonna read this part to y'all man it's gonna make you dribble gods very excited if you made it this far in the video type type iso god in the motherfucking uh,
comment section and like the fucking video, bitch. Anyways, on the ball handling front, we added the ability to do triple threat, dribble, and post moves by tapping or double tapping the post up button. I know the pro stick can be a little daunting for newcomers, so I think this feature will help them pull off some nice moves without worrying about getting accidental shots. Before you dribble gods out there, read on. The signature size up combos that you know and love will make their return. But we've also brought back the more explosive rhythm dribble sequence is, including a number of street ones. So they probably got some street niggas going crazy, nigga. <laughs> that we had a couple years back. Oh, they just old one. So they probably got the one where you do that dribble shit and then you like throw it behind your head and you like start. They had that in 15. I don't know if you niggas, <laughs> I don't know if y'all played that shit. But um, then he said that had blah, 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 including dozens of new animations for many of the top ball handlers in the league. We'll see. Simply type the right stick toward the hoop and you'll see some really sick dribble combos tons of new content so they bring it back that 16 shit it seemed like it's extremely gratifying this year to be able to chain together rhythm dribbles with the pro stick flick combos to create Kyrie Irving style mixtapes like I've been telling you like I've been telling like I've been telling you nigga dribble gods ain't going nowhere nigga fuck you talking about bruh <laughs> i've been telling y'all man let me let me read on where the fuck was i hold up <laughs> we've also added the ability to do walking size ups and combos it may sound like a small addiction but it's one of my favorite things to do as a ball handler this year we were in mocap watching guys play one-on-one -on -one nearly every possession they were pulling off these creep up dribble size ups before attacking the rim or pulling up for jumpers. Frankly, it baffled me that we never supported them as it, wait, where, where the fuck am I? <laughs> as it's such a, I don't know what the fuck that word is, part of the game, but I'm happy to say that now you could do double crosses, cross to raps, Cross to tweens, hezzy crosses. I don't know what the fuck this shit is, nigga. I ain't no dribbler. But li listen to this. This is the easily the deepest ball handling has ever been in any game. But the best thing about it is seeing the community invent all sort of combos. I didn't even know were possible when designing the system. Seeing this creativity is one of the things I look forward to most every year. So get those 2K TV top plays ready, man. So apparently, as they say every year, basically, they say they fix stealing, they say they fix spamming, they say they fix blocking, they really don't. But here, here's what they're saying they're gonna fix for this game. Um, people are gonna be more vulnerable this year to getting blown past when they start reaching and shit, and there's gonna be more fouls called, most likely. I doubt it, bro. They say this every year. They also say with with uh, dunks, when it comes to blocking, when you do one hands, you're going to be more vulnerable to getting blocked. So man, hopefully that matters because, you know, in real life, when you dunk with two hands, it's more safe. This year, the best animations to have for the quickest dunks, this is why I'm a dunk guy. A lot of people don't know this, is one-handed dunks. You go fast. You need one two hand just in case, you know, when you're getting trailed and shit. But that basically wraps up all this whole blog. If you want to read this shit yourself, <laughs> I don't think you want it to. You, you niggas could just listen to Young Swan break this shit down. IQ God Sensei. Hopefully we blow up on motherfucking 2K18. If you made it this far, type Go God in the motherfucking comments. Be sure to like this video. I know you nigg young niggas going back to school. Don't be on 2K too heavy. It, no matter how much you like it, stay in school, you know? Get some good grades. Play all the sports you can, even if you ask, and you'll be become a better motherfucking man. Be as athletic as possible. Tell your friends about Young Swan. And I'm out this bitch, man. Um, Yeah, like the video. Sub if you know. I don't know how long this fucking video is, but fuck with your boy, man. Adios.
about it. 